talking about the brush, you know, that just yeah. lit up and it's just rolling through that brush. And then, of course, it gets up into the trees, like you said. See, north winds carrying that smoke down the coast, kind of interesting. Uh, so there's where the fire is. And the north winds have just been sort of funneling it down for a couple of days. And the fire is growing and the smoke plume obviously is growing. For us, it's very, very light amounts of smoke, mostly in the upper atmosphere. And you also notice, so the north wind's dragging it down to the south. And then when we get our westerly sea breeze, it kind of pushes it off to the east. Uh, but we're getting some of that. And that's some of that haze. And you might be able to smell a little bit of it too. It doesn't quite smell like smoke. Most of it's in the upper atmosphere, but it definitely has a different uh, sort of tinge out there. If you look closely, Skycam 8 Santa Cruz, uh, clear skies, but again with the haze. Uh, so we've got a nice afternoon going there at the boardwalk. Goodness, you look at that, you just go, is that Saturday? Nope, that's a Wednesday in July. All the kids out, of course, enjoying that. The other side of the bay, as we said, would not clear today, and we didn't get any sunshine out at the harbor there in Monterey, so we're still overcast. It's not going anywhere this time of day. Temperature-wise, 60 Monterey, 73 Santa Cruz, 79 Gilroy, and mostly 70s inland at least close to the coast meaning your Gilroy's Morgan Hills and down to King City if you move far enough inland uh, where we got the blocking mechanism called the uh, sand the the forest down of course from Big Sur and then inland uh, you're not going to get any kind of a sea breeze so uh, the interior parts that's where you just don't get the breeze 400 league at 98 96 Bradley 98 Parkfield tomorrow probably over 100 90 in San Arto this was the coolest day of the week so enjoy that after that, things will start ramping up again. Northwesterly is about 5 to 15, and overall, a light breeze, uh, you know, a little breezy, but not bad. Visible satellite imagery showing the low clouds this morning. We had a deeper marine layer. Uh, it's already coming back. See that hole that developed? You can also see how it's sort of uh, starting to fade, right? It's starting to close up that little gap there in Santa Cruz, so enjoy the sun while you've got it. Otherwise, a few showers and thunderstorms definitely had some lightning strikes up in the Sierra. Most of that's moved off into Nevada now and uh, headed off to the north and east. For tonight, 50 to 58. We got the coastal low clouds spreading back inland. Some patchy dense fog in the mix. 61 to 72 tomorrow at the coast. Valleys and hills will start warming up again tomorrow. 73 to 90 with sunshine. So, you know, our valleys will be in the middle and upper 80s to around 90, but those hot spots probably 95 to 103 and that's the start of some heat and we do have some heat advisories that we'll talk about for Friday and Saturday and we'll also have the Rodeo forecast.